Now, are you ready, Mistress Cass? Very well. Let me adjust my place, please. One of the first people in quite a long time that I don't need to bend down to service. Hmm. Do you dye your hair this color? It's rather fluorescent, don't you think? <laughs> All righty then, let's begin. So much hair to work with. It's a little tangled down here at the end. That is to be expected, though. Quite a few split ends back here. Don't worry, we can fix those. Ah, and your poor little ears. Hmm. Then let's begin with some of these more pressing concerns. Such a cute face. Excellent. Now, I'll get you to hold very still for me, okay? Excellent.
Such a wonderful, wonderful client you have been. Let me just kill the remainder of this arm for you. A little bit wet. I mean dry. <laughs> And there we go. All done. I hope you enjoyed that. I cannot understand what you're saying. You loved the haircut. Ah, excellent. <laughs> you are welcome. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Are your sound effects turned on? I would assume they are, after that little eye show you gave me. Very well, then. Let us begin. I've seen this hair around quite a lot. Always on your head, though. Many times, I thought, how long do you go before you actually take care of your hair? It always seems trimmed and proper, but you never really know. It seems that everyone I meet lately has some form of growth in their head. Whether it's ears, horns, in some cases tails, or in cases like night shift over here, ears and owl feathers. Hmm. Okay, don't panic. Is going to give you a little trim. Ah, tall avatars. It seems that everyone who is rather tall seems to have extremely long hair. Only the small ones seem to have short haircuts. Hmm. Let's line up that fringe once more, shall we? Okay, now I'll get you to hold your head extremely still for me, okay?
his host. Very cold. <sighs> How could I forget your little ears up here? And we'll get rid of that tufted hair just on the tip of there. And with that, we're all done, Mr. Cookie. I hope you enjoyed that. Ha ha ha.